is that uh, uh, she's friends with who I went to Idol Tower, and the, it was posted on my social media. Someone else posted it. It's like whatever. I wasn't doing anything bad. I could. I really. I honestly don't care about that part. But you know what? Are we alone? Yeah. <laughs> if you're gonna call me out, I'm gonna you up. <laughs> Sorry, that's just me. <laughs> you know, they forget that there's real people on the other side of those those letters that they're writing. Yes. We're real community members. We have kids or have known kids that have gone to these schools. Right. Have an invested interest in this process and they don't know what we right. do behind the scenes. And it's really unfortunate exactly. that they, they want to pick on us because right. they want their babysitters back. Right. 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 I, I agree, and it's fine. It's just it, I, I just need to get you know, up. And you know, I, I I totally hear that because my brother had a, a delivery. Yeah, my brother had a delivery service for medical marijuana. The high clientele were parents with their kids in school. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. And so when you got when you got your kids at home, no more Friday, no more <laughs> yeah, smoke dog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. your quarterback, your quarterback might be traded. I'm not happy. I heard Frankie's not happy. Right. All three of our candidates are on and ready to go when we're ready to go. Okay. Uh oh. Laura Lanier, just FYI, you guys have the meeting. Oh, we have the meeting open to the public right now. Nuh uh. That's what Laura just said. Great. We were really struggling at that moment with all of the board comments that were coming in because we want what's best for kids so badly. I will not make excuses for what happened or why it happened. I am the superintendent. I am responsible and accountable, and I'm truly sorry for what took place.